another day of adventure. <laughs> we have to head down to that bank appointment for 11 o'clock. It's around 10.30 right now. Uh, didn't have time to shave, nothing. I just got up, worked right until this last second I went to go. Uh, the vlog, I don't know why it's taking so long to process on YouTube's end, but uh, it looks like it's still at 240p or whatever it's called. Uh, it still hasn't hit HD and uh, I don't launch it until it, hit, it hits HD. And for some reason, this particular video is taking way too long to do that. It's kind of freaking me out a bit. Anyway, so we're heading down to the bank uh, in Newmarket. Not sure what else I'm gonna do in Newmarket. I'll think about it when I'm down there. Uh, and then later on this afternoon, I gotta put the new tires on this car. So I've got all the, so we're still on snow tires right now. So we've got this, the old rims and uh, summer tires in the back. So I have an appointment for 3.30, I think, up in Barrie. So I'm going to zigzag in all over Ontario today. But uh, let's, let's try to make this into a cool vlog. down to Newmarket, back to the same bank, National. Just uh, got to see if we can consolidate some money and uh, then we'll see what we're going to do after that. Hi, I have an appointment uh, to see, I guess, a loan manager. Yes. I'm trying to wait. It's not loading and I'm trying to figure out who, it, who I'm talking to. <laughs> so, Ken. Yeah. All right, all finished up at the bank. Got my moolah. Now consolidate all my outstanding debt from last year's kerfuffles. Made it up to Bradford at the Royal Bank to deposit my check, and uh, then we're gonna grab some food. I don't know where we're gonna go. Maybe St. Louis. Mm. The money's in the bank. Can't wait to get home and, and move it around. I don't know what I want for lunch. Dang damn it. Yeah, I changed my mind. I think I'm gonna go to a St. Louis Bar and Grill. I'm not sure what I'm gonna eat. Nothing too big. I need to do some banking and stuff and uh, hang out for a minute. Let's go. Lunch is done. That's pretty good. So I had the half triple decker club, which was fantastic by the way. You had to squish it down, man. It wouldn't fit in your mouth. <laughs> That's how big it was. And uh, the soup, and the soup of the day today was uh, cheddar 
and broccoli potato or something like that. She said it to me twice and I couldn't remember the combination of things that were in that soup, but it was very cheesy. When you have facial hair, maybe I would not recommend because you have to continually wipe your face because of the strings of cheese coming out of the soup sticking to your beard. Anyway, thank you very much, uh, St. Louis. I came to like, I think it was like 17, 16, 17 dollars for the beer, the soup, the sandwich, and then the tax and tip came to like 1998. So almost 20 bucks for lunch, which I think is pretty good. It's, it's not McDonald's uh, and fast food style, you know, it's sit down, you got a beer, the beer jacked it up. I think the actual, the lunch combo, if you had that with a water, uh, it probably cost you like nine, or sorry, it was, I think it was $7.98. $7.98 for that, I think I saw on the menu. Yeah, but the beer jacked up the price. Okay, let's go to our next destination, tire time. Barry, I'm at uh, Superior Tire and Auto. Superior Tire and Auto. So I'm way early for my appointment, but I have nowhere else to go right now. So I'm just gonna bring my laptop. Okay, that just can stay like that. Yeah, let's do this. We'll have to go give our keys. I'll leave it unlocked. Should be all right. So, the people here at Superior Tire are rock. They are awesome. On the freaking wind, they're gonna slip me in early if they can. And uh, so I'm just gonna zip across the street and there's a Dairy Queen over there and get myself a small milkshake. What do you think? Let's do it. Can I get a small chocolate shake, please? Do you want the whipped cream and cherry that comes on it? Uh, yes, please. Thank you. Show the logo. All done, my milkshake. I shouldn't have had the milkshake. I apologize to my body. I should have had like a big water or something. I think there's a convenience store over there. We'll hit the convenience store, grab some water. It's funny, just before I left the house, I was going to grab a, one of my Camelback water jugs. I'm like, nah, I won't need it. Yeah, I needed it. Now it's not windy. Jeez. All done. Look at those. So the final bill was $647. That's the tire right there. Kumo, Kumo. Nice, nice clean tires. Brand new spanking tires. Sweet. My phone's dead, so I gotta get in and charge it. Looks good. It's 345, all done at Superior Tire. Uh, I'm gonna have to come back and bring my car but I want to make an appointment. I'm going to probably go online and look for the, uh, the similar, most similar tires on their, on their website and then come back and get my Suzuki done. But uh, I'm glad it was only 600 and something dollars. I thought it was going to be way more. I, th I honestly thought it was going to be like 800 to to $1,000. I haven't, haven't had to buy tires in a while, so I thought they were more expensive. All right, let's go home. So 
about 6.30 now. I should have done my my live my live show tonight. I don't want to do another one right after the last one. But anyway, uh, 6.30, like Carol's out, my daughter's out, Ben's playing video games. So tonight would have been a good night also to do a live stream. So I thought since it's really nice outside to go for a walk, I only did like about 3,400 steps a day. I guess I spent most of my day, although I was rushing around a little bit, I spent most of my day sitting in a car uh, or drinking milkshakes. So I'm gonna go for half an hour walk around. I don't wanna go for a bike ride because my back's sore from, from boxing. So uh, I'm gonna uh, just go for a leisurely walk around the area. I might, I'll take Sam first and then I'll do my walk a little bit faster. Sam's a sniffer. He can't walk with Sam, he doesn't, he doesn't walk. Um, our black lab we used to have a long time ago, he loved walking, he would go. Uh, he'd, you could go with a bike ride. We call, used to call it bike rides and we'd go for a bike ride. Now I'm just rambling, I apologize. So I leave you with this guys, with this beautiful sunset. Have a great evening and we'll see you again tomorrow.